The LG G3 has an on-screen navigation bar. Now unfortunately it's going to get in the way of some games, like Nova 3 which I'm playing now. But what if I could tell you could get rid of those navigation buttons altogether to get a fully immersive experience? Well today I'm going to be showing you how to do that on the LG G3 and as it's built into the actual device itself, you don't need root or anything like that. I'm Michael from Copper vs Glass, let's take a look. Okay guys, so the way this is done is actually quite simple. What you want to do is head into the settings on the G3, go down to display, then you're going to write down the bottom to where it says home touch buttons. And it says last option here where it says hide the home touch buttons. And you can see here it says choose to show or hide the home touch buttons while using apps. It does mention though that some functionality within certain applications may be lost, but in terms of the applications that I've been using the immersive mode in, I've not had any issues whatsoever. And then it's basically as simple as ticking the applications where you want to use the immersive mode. So you can do things like the Google camera, you've got Chrome, other applications like social networks like Facebook, Google Plus and Twitter, you can also do it with these applications as well. Now obviously at the start of this video you saw me doing it with Nova Launcher, the home touch buttons disappeared completely and that's because when I go down to Nova Launcher you can see that I've actually got Nova Launcher ticked. So what that means is there's no touch buttons or anything like that in the actual game itself and you have to kind of swipe in to get to those buttons. So what I'm going to do, I'm just going to show you just doing it with another application. So I've got here Google Play Music. So again, I'm just going to tick that. And then when I go into Google Play Music, you're going to see there's no touch buttons at all. Now initially they are there, but then they disappear completely. So what this now allowed me to do is have a fully immersive experience and actually does make the screen feel a bit bigger. Now the way you can get back to those buttons, you can either swipe down from the top and they will appear. Or well, the easiest way to do it is just, just to swipe up from the bottom and you will get the touch button straight away and then you can interact with them as normal for multitasking and also home. So it's a really neat feature and it's a really great way to get a full immersive experience on the LG G3 and it works with pretty much any application. Now the reason why is because Android has certain phones, for instance the Galaxy S5, where there are no home touch buttons and it's all done with physical buttons. So what this means is applications are made to fit a screen with no buttons on it. So like I said, this is a great way to get a full immersive experience on the LG G3. I'm Michael from Copper vs Glass, and I will catch you guys in the next video.